Hi guys, this is Rara Coco. Quick update with regards to ticker symbol BBIG. So I'm seeing a bullish, bullish uh, reversal that is about to happen very, very soon. Uh, possibly uh, the next few days, starting today or the next few days, there is a massive, massive signal that is about to happen with BBIG. Here is why, okay? FYI, the shares outstanding for BBIG is 233.14 million, okay? That is what is the total shares available outstanding for BBIG. Now, the free float is totally different. Free float is the shares that is available to be trade in to be buy and sold in the NASDAQ, which is the free float shares of 176.35 million. Take a note of that. That is a very, very important information. If you look at that, that 176, 50 million of that was shares on loan, 50.1 million shares on loan, okay? This is massive, 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 shares okay that has been borrowed okay also the utilization right now for bbig is at 100 percent, and then cost to borrow current is 127.86 percent this is huge cost to borrow 127.86 percent this is very uh, huge now guys BBIG, if you look at what's on loan, all right, this trends right here is an uptrend, right? This is an indication why the short sellers, the market makers are borrowing shares. It's because the buyers of BBIG are holding and they're not selling. The more they borrow shares, the more they can bring the price down of BBIG. And the reason why they are keep borrowing the shares, it's because BBIG buyers are holding the shares and they are not selling. If you look at on this area, this is June 10, 2021. The shares on loan was 7.23 million. Okay. Seven or let's take a look at here. On June 7, okay, 2021, which is last year right the shares on loan was 5.94 million 5.94 million because the retails are holding and they're not selling they keep borrowing and borrowing shares to keep the price down of bbig to close to two dollars right so from here one year after now we are at 50.1 million shares borrowed and they have not returned. Instead of returning, they increased their position. Now it's 50.1 million. Let me prove it to you some more. All right, let's take a look at this information right here. This is also BBIG, okay? This is BBIG and it is reported in the NASDAQ, okay? NASDAQ. Take a look at this, August, August 14. 2020, August 25, 2020, it is reported, it was reported that the shares shorted, it's only 95,000, zero K, 95,000 only. Now, they could have closed that position, but because the buyers of BBIG are holding and they are not selling, they keep increasing their position now to 20 million, to 20,000, to 101,000, to 126,000 on March 24, to 1.99 million on April 26, to 4.74 million on June 24. It keeps increasing to 7.82 million on July 26, 2021, 11.67 million on August 21, uh, August 24, 2021. Okay, now right here is 25 million on October, 30 million on December 31st, right? 
December 31st, massive, massive, massive. And right now, still current short interest, 30.25 million, 17.16% uh, of that is uh, shorted. If you look at this area here, it was shorted at a very, very small amount and they keep increasing on this area, right? Increasing and rising. It's just an indicative that the buyers of BBIG, when they are holding realistically, BBIG uh, holders or shares are the one that is winning. It's because when they start to close this position, this 50.1 million, then BBIG shares will go to three digits up to four digits, okay, when it closes. And BBIG will make so much, so much millionaires on the retails. Now, this is when is the nuclear MOAS is going to happen? When is that going to happen? Well, what it's going to happen is there is no guarantee on when is it going to happen, what date or what time. It's a matter of this short sellers market makers closing this 50.1 million. And if they close this 50.1 million, a massive run up to three to four digit price of BBIG, which will make a lot of retails millionaires. When is that going to happen? It's going to happen. It's because we are applying pressure. The more we are holding the stock, the more they have to borrow shares of BBIG, the more they have to pay interest on BBIG. So if you look at it, they are paying 127.86% of interest right here, cost to borrow. When we buy the shares, we, the retail, we don't pay interest, we just keep holding. And when we keep holding, they have to borrow more shares of BBIG to bring the price down. And then when they keep doing that, the retail is also buying more shares and holding, bringing the price to as much as possible, holding that price, right? But once they close their position, they are in a massive, massive, massive trouble. Guys, this is a matter of identifying what is your position. Now, what's good about this BBIG is there is a nuclear MOAS play and there's a long play. Can you imagine from quarter four to quarter one, they almost increase their profits or income to 400% from Q4 now to Q1. They have increased their uh, income to almost 400%. Let that sink in. So let's on, on, on quarter one to quarter uh, two, there's going to be another massive, massive, massive uh, increase of income due to the ad riser and low motive. And I have a feeling that it will go over 1000% uh, better than Q1. Um, and then when they report that, there's going to be a massive, 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 massive run up of um, BBIG. And when that happens, they're going to borrow more shares and they're going to be in so much trouble. And when they close their position, we're going to be on the three digit to four digit price of BBIG and we're going to be millionaires. Guys, it's the conviction. It's what your faith is. It's what you believe in. Okay. If you understand the situation, this is how it works. You buy and hold. The retail fights back, borrowed more money. We buy and hold. The, the, the short sellers, the market makers, hedge funds, they fight back. They borrow more shares to bring the price down of BBIG, and then us, we buy and hold. We buy and hold and repeat. We buy and hold and repeat and accumulate. When we keep doing that, we're the one who's going to win, and they're the one who's going to lose because at this time, they're paying this much percentage, cost of borrow of 127.86. And we, when we hold our stock, it, we pay zero interest. And whatever the price action right now, which is $2, that is nothing. Okay, so right now, uh, BBIG is trading at $2.07, okay? Load up, load up, buy, 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 buy. Uh, I'm not a financial advisor. I got the information here for you. It's up to you to use that. You have to use your own due diligence. 
I'm not telling you what to do. I am not a financial advisor. My name is Wara Koko. Thank you very much for watching. Please, uh, may you have love, peace, prosperity. Be with you all, okay? And good health. Thank you very much, and you have a great day. Nuclear Moas, if you buy, hold, and repeat. Nuclear Moas, if you buy, hold, and repeat. Understanding the situation, understanding what's going on. There is the Nuclear Moas play, and there's also a long, long play with uh, BBIG. So no matter what, this price action right now, you're going to be surprised the minute you woke up the next day, all of a sudden your portfolio is the price of BBIG is all of a sudden is 500 a share or 1000 a share. You will be very, very surprised when that happens. It's because it's about to happen. It's going to happen. It's because the share sellers, the market makers and the hedge funds are in so much trouble. They are trapped. They can't get out right now. The only way they're going to get out is all of us selling our shares. Okay. If we sell all of our shares, uh, to them, they get back the actual share, then yes, uh, there will be no nuclear MOAS. But I believe in this, and I believe that you guys are holding, and that's why I'm going to hold with you. I own massive, 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 massive shares of BBIG. Thank you very much, guys, and you have a great day.